Hey, what's up, masterminds? All right, we are going to go over uh, three sections here for setting up your online storefront. All right, these are the most crucial. This is what gets you out in the open and what really truly gets you excited for, you know, getting people to go to your website and drive traffic and uh, gain more revenue by adding uh, additional clients and, and prospects. The very easy to use tool. Uh, that captures all of that data of all of these uh, people that are going online now and now going to your website as well. Okay, so this is uh, for not only the, the folks that have just signed up and wanting to know exactly what they should do next. There's really three very simple steps that you must do. You have to do it. It is so important and I'll tell you why right now. Uh, also for those folks that are kind of on the fence uh, about what's going on and like if I were to start an online presence and I wanted to do a little bit more about outreach uh, but also saving time as well. Um, there's three very crucial things here and that's in the settings here and that's what we've got up. So for those that are uh, subscribed to the online storefront you're probably already familiar with this when you do log in. Those that aren't familiar, when you do sign up and get everything uh, you know provided, uh, such as your broker information, we create the profile for you. And this is what it's going to look like. The very next step, because we've just created the shell, we need to make sure that everything is synced up absolutely perfect. And we do need your help with that, with, again, these three steps, and that's here in the settings. So over in the settings, under Agency Preferences, you have your agent of record IDs, you have your online application settings, and we have select your plans. So why are these three things so important? Because one, with the agent of record IDs, that information gets stamped on any application that has the uh, ability to be done online. So if a consumer does go onto your website and they see uh, a plan that they want to enroll on, when they do type in their information, they may not ever, ever need to talk to you that information goes to the carrier. You want to make sure that your agent ID number is stamped on there so you get credit for it when it goes over automatically. The online application, this is for any carrier that has some information or a their own special affiliate link is what we call them or online enrollment tool or quote and apply tool, whatever that may be. Uh, so this it goes a little bit more in depth that we're going to show you in uh, video number two and uh, select your plans. This is what you want the client or the customer to see on your website. So by choosing the different plans and the carriers that you're appointed with, uh, this by simply clicking a few, a few buttons will show up on your website so that way they browse based off of your appointments. Now in terms of appointments, don't even worry about it. The most important thing right now is getting everything uh, updated and set up based off of what you currently sell right now. Once you get that up and running and you see the success and you see the outreach that we're going to train you on as well, uh, we want to get you appointed with more carriers. So just let us know what other carriers you want to get appointed with. We will help you. And as that goes on organically, we will add those uh, to your portfolio and to the client experience so they have more options. All right, so these next three episodes, they're, they're going to go over the agent of record IDs, online application settings, and selecting your plans. Now, uh, two things I want to go over are the implications if you don't do this right away. Number one, if you don't do this stuff right away, a couple of things are going to happen. Number one, you're going to have a consumer that's going to go online and see a bunch of carriers and plans that you're not appointed with because you didn't take care of it here in steps one, two, and three, they, they can apply for that information. And if it goes to the carrier without your agent information on it, guess what? They are going to get enrolled, but you're not going to get any credit. So that's why it's very crucial to take care of these three steps here. Um, the other thing as well, if, uh, if you don't do any of this information, it really renders the, uh, the website uh, completely pointless, to be quite honest. This is an online storefront. This is a CRM, and this is a multi-carrier quoting tool. So you can go in, you can manually quote a particular carrier or a, a client that has uh, some special needs. Uh, you have an online storefront. You want to make this actually meaningful. And if you don't take care of these three steps, 
then it's really not going to do anything other than just be this website where people can contact you and you're right back to square one. All right, square one is not is not where we want to be. We want to be making two hundred and fifty thousand dollars in new revenue. We want to make be making five hundred. We want to be making that one million dollars in revenue, and we can't do that if we are uh, sitting on the phone with a client, gathering their details, and going back and doing some random quotes, and then coming back a few days later. That takes up too much time. This is supposed to alleviate the burden of of time by having more clients come in and not being a slave to your desk. That's really what this is all about. And you can do that by getting through steps one, two, and three. And it's just really just a few clicks of a button. Honestly, that's all it is. And I'm going to show you how in the next couple of episodes. All right. So that's that's the, um, the implications of if we don't take care of this. Because again, if we don't take care of these right now, we do need your help to, to go through these uh, three little steps. Um, but if you don't do it, then it... it it's basically just like this this dead website that nobody's going to go to, and we want to make sure that you do get a return on your investment. That's really what we want to do. Uh, so in order to start talking about marketing, start talking about outreach, start talking about uh, additional appointments, um, we can't do that unless we take care of the first three steps. All right, you got to take care of yourself before you can start looking at growth. So that's that, that brings me to uh, item number two, and that actually is growth. So whether you have one appointment, whether you have two appointments with two different carriers, get yourself set up and only talk about and get set up with the, the carriers that you're appointed with. Once you're up and running, we're going to show you how to use this website so you can go out and say, okay, hey, if you are a, a prospective customer that uh, may be in need of my services, come to my website. You're basically sh driving traffic to this website to collect all of that data so you're not on the phone talking with a bunch of people and then typing in all of this information manually this is automatically happening because the consumers are going on your website now typing in that information you're capturing that real time with your CRM so that again saves you more time so while that's happening once you are set up with steps one two and three then we can start talking about appointments right maybe there's some other things that you are interested in selling uh, maybe it's life, maybe it's universal life, maybe it's uh, some kind of annuity, maybe uh, additional uh, dental and vision carriers that you want. Who knows what it may be, but it's something that we are going to talk about. We are going to engage with you on this because once you have the website set up, you can now go, okay, what else can I offer to my clients? Let's add them in. And it's a very simple process by simply calling us and say, I want to get appointed with this carrier, with this carrier, with this carrier. We'll even make recommendations. And really from that point on, once you get these three key uh, uh, sections taken care of, that's all it's going to be. You just give us a call or we'll make a recommendation and say, hey, we should get you appointed with this. We click a few buttons, we turn a few things on, it goes on the website. These people can actually uh, now view all of this information and get enrolled. And in many cases, they may, may never even uh, speak with you directly, right? And, and that saves you on time. And that's where we want to get you. We want to get you to a point where all you really have to do is click a few buttons to do some outreach have these potential customers come to your website, fill in their information. You get access to their entire information because they're voluntarily filling this information out. And then, and then what happens? They either apply online or you follow up with them and say, hey, what else do you need? What else can I provide for you? What else can I quote for you? And that way you can not only upsell, um, but you can actually not be tied to your desk by filling out all this information manually they're doing it on their own of their own free will and volition so with that you can gain more access to more clients and and just simply do more and that's where we want to be i want us to all work together to make sure that we can do this together share our best practices share our success stories and yeah let's ramp it up you know let's see like okay what will it take to get two hundred and fifty thousand dollars in in uh, annual premium, then five hundred, then seven fifty, then a million. 
like how how far can we go and we've already seen some success with many brokers that are doing this as well and we want to do that with you too but really it just takes these three steps I'm going to show you how simple these are in the next couple of episodes all right so stay tuned and get ready for more